Today is Sunday, and Sunday in our house means it's pizza day. And we don't just go out and buy a pizza, we actually make it from scratch. And the big thing there is to make our own dough. So we're gonna get right into it. And you can see that I've got my trusty sous chef, Livy, right by me. You ready to make some pizza, Liz? You ready to make our dough? Now using a bread maker makes it really easy to make the dough. We're gonna put our ingredients in. First our water, then our olive oil goes in. Then we throw in our flour. Then we put our sugar in. Next we have some salt. And finally, we put our yeast in. And that's all there is to it. Now all I do is put it in the bread maker, turn it on and let it go. about an hour and a half, we will have fresh dough. As silly as it sounds, Pizza Sunday is something we look forward to all week. We actually talk about it during the week and say, hey, it's almost Pizza Sunday. So waiting for the dough to cook is actually the hardest thing. But there are some good things about waiting. I get to spend a lot of time with Livy, and we get to have some fun together. The other thing that I like to do while we're waiting for the dough to rise is to get all the toppings ready. So today I'm using some pineapple, some ham, and some onions too. Now it's definitely better with bacon, as most things are. But when I don't have bacon, I use some spicy sausage instead. We've been waiting now for almost an hour and a half. The dough is almost ready. I think there's less than a minute left. We're just waiting for that beep. There it is. All right, now it's time to put that dough on some pizza trays and get cooking. Of course, when making pizza, you have to toss the dough at least once. About twice. Now the trick for some great tasting pizza is to never forget the crust. I always put some olive oil on it and some garlic powder and a little bit of salt. You always want to have a great taste right at the end of that pizza. thing is sauce, and I think Livy might have that for us. Well, they look good. They're almost ready to go. The last thing, you have to put some hot sauce on part of it. I'm the only one in this family who likes hot sauce. I'll just put a little bit over here. Pizzas are ready to go. I'm going to put the oven at 500, put them right in, and wait for about 20 minutes. Looks to me like it's time to flip them. I think our pizzas are done. 
Should we get him out? Yeah, I think we should. All right. Let's get him out. That's a good looking pizza. I think we're ready to eat. I'm gonna say thank you to my sous chef here. Our pizzas are done. You ready to have a little bit to eat too? <laughs> All right. Give me a little high fives. High five, woo! All right, now the best part of the evening, we get to eat the pizza. What do you say? All right, let's dig in.